Ciao a tutti! Hello everyone! Welcome to Fly High, where you're going to be flying high in language learning with me, Francesca. And me, James. And in this lesson, we'll be learning the Italian alphabet. Let's explore it together. So we're going to be going through the old alphabet from A to C. Al dalla alla z and uh, the Italian alphabet doesn't have J, K, X, Y, and Z. What? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it doesn't have them, and uh, it's because um, it's because they're foreign letters. Basically, they're not. Uh, we don't really have any words uh, that are Italian that actually start with these. Um, with these letters unless they are imported from um, from outside so basically. more surprises in the italian language for me yes and so it's only else. yeah <laughs> italian uh, the italian alphabet only got like it's only got 21 letters okay, 21 letters not 26 mm, yes okay. so we can start now with a a let's a. repeat it yes okay. a a di amore a di when i say a di a as or a like mm? okay. a di amore or uh, a di acqua mm? yeah. amore love uh, uh, acqua water mm? then we have b b yes mm. b uh, b di bambino bambino is the male child mm. male and b di bacio bacio is kiss and mm? you could say b for an english alternative would be like um B as in the, the insect. Yes, Same pronunciation. B. Yes, yeah, B. Yeah. yeah. Uh, then we have chi. Chi. Looks like key for me, but I'll go. Chi. Yeah, yeah, I remember those rules. Uh, chi. Chi. Yeah. Yes, chi. Uh, the sound, uh, the C, can have two sounds in Italian. Mm. It can be uh, a k sound, like casa, cosa, mm. and cucina. So casa is house, cosa is thing, and cucina is kitchen, mm -hmm. so it's a hard, it's a hard C, mm -hmm. and this is a hard C when you see casa, there's a C, and then the A, cosa, the C, and the O afterwards, mm -hmm. and then cucina, C, and the U, so the C followed by A, O, or U, okay, U, so A, uh, O, and U, it takes a, a harder sound, okay? okay? Yeah, makes sense. While when it's, let's say, città, città is city, or centro, there is center, mm -hmm. uh, so when the C is followed by an I or an E, mm -hmm. so E and A in Italian, which we're going to be seeing like shortly, then it takes a, so, a, a, we call it dolce, okay? So it's soft, the C yeah. is soft, C. Mm -hmm. So you wouldn't, again, you wouldn't pronounce it città or centro. Yes, yeah, yeah. Uh, the sound uh, yes, well, yes. So. so it has to be, you know, Cita, città, centro. centro. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then we have D. D is easy, same. Yeah, D. D, yeah. yes. So D, uh, D donna, or uh, delfino, woman, or mm -hmm. dolphin. Then we have E. E? Yes, mm -hmm. E. Uh, e can have two sounds here as well. So can have like a closed E, like elegante, mm -hmm. elegant. Elegant, and then an open, uh, it could also be an open E, like echo. Echo is here, it is here. Mm -hmm. uh, so you see, elegante, closed E, and echo, like an open, yeah. open sound E. Mm -hmm. Obviously, um, I've got to watch out for it on automatic say E for yes. myself. So, which we find out later, the, the you know, how we pronounce E would be for the I. Yes, so, yes. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that's the only few I, I know um, yeah. for this for these lessons anyway. Yeah, and then we have F. F is F. Mm? F. F. So you yes. have to do a F at the end. F. Yes. Okay. Yes. F. No. F. No. Oh, F. F. <laughs> okay. F di famiglia, family, mm. or forza. Forza is strength, power. Mm. Mm? And then we have G. G. Yes. Oh. G. Simple G. G. Again, like, this is like the C sound, so uh, it has a hard sound when it's followed by an A, an O, or a U, like gatto, cat, yeah. uh, goccia, drop, and guerra, war. Mm -hmm. 
So in this case, it's a hard sound. When it's followed by a E or a E, so an E or an I, yeah. then it's a, a soft sound, J. So gente, mm -hmm. gente is people, or gita. Gita is like an excursion yeah. uh, out. So that was a good, perfect example with an A and an E then. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then we have H. H is H. 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 Yes, H. And the H in Italian is mute. So we don't pronounce it. It's there, but it's as if it wasn't there in terms of pronunciation. Yeah, I know okay. you guys have a... A thing with H's. Yes, <laughs> in English, because we know you're yeah, still pronouncing them in, uh, uh, in it's, Italian. It's kind of swept underneath the rug, the H. Yeah, <laughs> so if you have to say hotel, hotel, you say hotel, mm. but in Italian is hotel. Hotel. Yeah? yeah, hotel, so we don't pronounce the H. Hmm? Then we have E. 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 Very good. E, uh, the idea. Idea is idea. I di isola, mm -hmm. so it always gets pronounced I, yeah. okay? And then we have L, 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 yes, L di lavoro, uh, lavoro is work or job, L di luna, luna is moon, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then we have M, M, yes, M di musica, musica is music, and M di mondo, mondo is world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's very similar, we say M, uh, but in a different way, for yeah. more children like. Um, so yeah, you just have to put that M. Yeah, M. Mm -hmm. And then we have N. 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 Yes, notte, for instance, night. And nome, name. Ah, yeah. mm -hmm. And then we have the O. O. Yes. So, O again can be uh, closed or open. Mm -hmm. uh, so, it can be uh, closed as in voce. Voce, you see, is closed O. Mm -hmm. So, voce is voice. And it can be open, like in opera. Okay, opera yeah, means yeah. it's opera or uh, work as well. Mm -hmm. Opera, you see the O, how, how, how open, open yeah. it is. Yes. And then we have P. P. P, yes. P, D, pizza. P di pane, okay? Mm. Simple pronunciation, P, really. And then we have Q. Q? Yes. Okay. Q. Q di quadro. Quadro is the picture. Mm. Mm. Quadro or questione. Yeah, it's weird because we say Q, Q, but yeah, this one's more Q. 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 Yes. Q. 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 <laughs> no, like an owl. <laughs> yes. Questione. And then we have R. R? R? Probably going to be a hard to I'm pronounce. not going to pronounce it. Er, no, that's it. I did that right. But R. R. Yes. See, I have, I have problems with the R's. Listen, listen. R. 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 Yeah. R. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. R di rosa. Mm -hmm. Rosa is a rose. Or riso. Riso, rice. Now let me mm -hmm. say rosa. Riso. Yeah. No, it's rosa, rosa. Rosa. Yeah, that's uh, not bad. Sounds then. like a purr. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't, don't try it. <laughs> no, and, don't try it. <laughs> yeah, and then S. 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 Si. S. S. di sole. Sole. Sun. Mm -hmm. And S. di sale, for instance, salt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, then we have T. T. Yes. Mm -hmm. T. di tavolo. Table. Mm -hmm. And the, the tempo, tempo is time, or also the weather. Yeah, mm? yeah. And then we have U. Oh, it's another U. U, very it's good. U. U. U di ufficio, uh, U di uomo, okay, mm -hmm. U. Mm -hmm. Then we have V. V? Yes. Oh, it's exactly the same. Yes, so, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. V di vita. Vita, for instance, life. Mm -hmm. V di via. Via, like a street. Mm? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then Z. Oh. Oh yeah. Straight zeta. straight to the, to yeah, the end. V yeah. Zeta. That's how we don't oh, see that guy said it. <laughs> <laughs> no 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 we haven't finished yet. Okay. Zeta. Zeta. Yes. Oh Zeta. Zeta, very good. Okay. Zeta di zaino, for instance, zaino is backpack. Mm -hmm. Zeta di zona, zone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, before I'm gonna be uh, reciting the alphabet all of it, uh, yeah. from uh, A to Z, but we can see uh, the five 
uh, the five external, the five foreign letters, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so we go, uh, in English would be J, in Italian it's called Ilunga. Wow, Ilunga. that is different. Yes, it's long I, long I, okay? Long I with a little, little uphill. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> long, yeah. Ilunga. Yeah. Uh, for instance, jolly. For instance, jolly is a uh, is a is a word that we use. Eh? Mm -hmm. uh, jolly, like in the um, Joker okay, uh, cards, yeah. is a jolly, uh, the jolly card. So ilunga. Ilunga, mm -hmm. yeah. Kappa, K okay, is kappa mm -hmm. in Italian, yeah. Kappa. Kappa, kappa in uh, for instance karate. We say karate. Huh? Oh. Um, yes, we we use the kappa. Obviously, you pronounce that really well. In karate. Karate, yeah. yeah. And then uh, we have uh, W. W is doppia V or doppia V, because we can say V or V, huh? okay. for the, for the V. Doppia V, doppia V. Yes, mm. or V doppia or V doppia. Mm? V doppia, V doppia. Yeah, mm. like in weekend. You see, we pronounce it, we tend to pronounce it the way um, that is pronounced in the, um, in the foreign word where it comes from, in the, foreign, in the language where it comes from. So, mm -hmm. you know, weekend, you pronounce it weekend, okay? okay. Waffer, we say waffer for, you say waffer, right? Yeah, waffer, yeah. We say waffer potentially because it comes from German. Okay. And then we pronounce it waffer. Uh, I got a quick one for I you. believe. I got a quick one for you. How would you pronounce burger? Burger. There we go, the famous burger. <laughs> yes, because you apply the rule of the U pronunciation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Burger. Burger. You pronounce the yes. Yeah, when I've uh, met you, obviously, you say, oh, Burger King or Burger. <laughs> I was like, what? Burger? Oh, burger. <laughs> yeah, well. No, it's, it's adorable. Burger. Yeah. <laughs> and then we have X. X. Oh, X. Yes, X is X. Okay, oh. X. X di Xilophono. Hmm? Oh. Xilophono. Xilophono. Okay. Yeah, xilophono. And then we have uh, the Y. Y is Y. We call it Y. So in the Greek way, or we can even say Y. Okay, so it's either we can say you can say Y or Y. y. Yeah. So Greek I, we call it Y or uh, the actual name of the letter is Y. Mm. So, and yogurt. Uh, yogurt. Yogurt. There we go. Yogurt. Pronunciation. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, I'm gonna be running through uh, these letters now from the uh, uh, Z uh, from A to Z, so that you you guys can all like hear it one by one, like in a normal normal speed. Uh, maybe a little bit slower than normal speed, mm -hmm. but yeah. A, B, C, D, E, F. G, H, I, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, Z. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I guess uh, we are at the end of the lesson for uh, today, mm -hmm. and I hope you guys enjoyed it and that you found it helpful. If you did, please let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And if you enjoyed this content, please like and subscribe. Thanks again so much for watching. Then stay tuned, and we'll see you in the next episode. Ciao. 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 ciao.